Hello everyone, my name is Mad Radio DX UK and this is a video where I'm letting everybody know that uh, my uh, TEF uh, receiver is available to tune online um, on the uh, FM uh, band available through the fmdx.org uh, website. So what you do is you go here into um, this website fmdx.org uh, okay and then here in this uh, top right uh, corner here you just click on this uh, right arrow to see the available uh, web servers online or remote TEF uh, receivers as well as other receivers that are available online and then if you want to find mine um, it's right here so you look at the map of the UK here I'm right in the south of England there you go Mad Radio DX uh, uh, Southampton okay and then you just click on connect there right and there you go look this is my uh, uh, TEF available online for anybody to tune now I just want to point out um, a couple of things first thing is that um, this is a test only for the time being um, I will leave it on uh, for the weekend uh, Saturday 10th and Sunday 11th of May 2025 uh, hopefully will be on all that time 24 7 but it's not going to be a permanent 24 7 thing um, at the moment because like I said I'm doing a test and there may be moments when I have to take it down um, say for testing purposes because I have to update the dashboard that you see in front of you or maybe because I might be doing other things where I will need um, the TEF receiver the antenna connection and uh, so on and the second thing is is that um, if you see more than one person um using the uh the tuner or using this web server uh, please ask for permission before using that uh you know before using this um tuner or server the reason is i don't want any fights happening on the you know on the, on my tuner itself everybody seems to uh, be well behaved when it comes to sharing um, the web servers so i hope it stays uh, that way so let uh, let's just have a quick listen to what we are uh, uh, what we tune to at the moment. Un grand poète de, de, de Calcutta. Et uh, je, je me souviens que parfois je, je, je marche. Okay, so uh, France coming in via tropospheric conditions here. And also a little nice uh, trick that you want to uh, use to see which uh, signals are strongest on the band. So you just click here on spectrum like I've done and you can see the peaks of the strong stations as well as other like weaker stations that might be uh, coming through. So I do urge you to use the spectrum um, utility here on the top. Um, like I said, to see which stations are peaking and which are not. And also as well, because um, at the time of doing this video, it's going to, well, it's supposed to be the e-skip uh, season, at least here in the UK. It hasn't really quite kicked off yet. Um, do have a look out because there might be, e you know, e-skip signals uh, about on the band, right? So, yeah, but at the moment, uh, no e-skip uh, so far. Seems to be taking its time coming here to the UK, at least in my area. I just hope it's not another... Um, disappointing uh, season like we've had the past few years here but for the time being you can listen to local stuff you can listen to uh, also other things stations from outside my area in the UK from the surrounding uh, towns city, uh, cities and uh, counties and also as well you can hear um, stuff from outside the UK still like for example France and Belgium that coming via tropospheric um, conditions. If you want any pointers, uh, the best Belgian stations I can get so far is uh, VRT Clara on 90.4, VRT1 on uh, 95.7, that could both come from the Egem relay in Belgium, and also for France, like for example this one here, 89.2, um, also 95.6, 95.4, usually uh, they're the uh, you know the best um, signals to come from France, but there could be others as well uh, as and when it happens. Um, so, like I said, just have a little tune around and see if you can find uh, anything you know uh, you know outside of the UK or anything exciting that uh, I might be receiving on my TEF receiver. So that's just a heads up. Um, if you want to have a tune around um, this weekend, like I said, it won't be a, a permanent twenty four seven thing. Um, but in any case, it's uh, just something I want to experiment with and I want to share with uh, everybody as well because I know that um, when I've done my live streams doing, um, you know, tuning the FM bands, people have really, uh, you know, really enjoyed it um, when I tune around uh, listening to, to all sorts, what I receive 
um, on the FM band uh, here in uh, my area. And I'm just showing my uh, TEF um, setup here for the uh, web server. So yeah, obviously got my TEF 6686 desktop, which I'm using as the uh, receiver for the uh, web server. Then I've got it connected via USB to my laptop uh, here. Um, I'm having to use a USB sound card um, to get the sound from the TEF um, desktop to my computer because the thing is modern laptops these days that don't come in with things like um, line in uh, microphone um, uh, sockets and uh, so on what you have to do is um, you have to buy uh, like I said this uh, USB sound card in order to have um, things like uh, line in and the microphone uh, sockets available so you can connect you know sound devices to uh, your laptop and uh, yeah, my laptop here that's running the uh, server soft, uh, software for the TEF uh, web uh, server. Yeah, uh, right now somebody's having a go at um, uh, tuning my receiver, as you can see there. You know, it's quite funny looking at it um, tuning on its own. It's like, oh, somebody's uh, taken over my, uh, you know, my TEF receiver. Well, of course, I've made it publicly available uh, for people to have a uh, tune around. So yeah, so just have uh, you know have yourselves a go at tuning my uh, receiver. Like I said, when it is um, available, um, and like I said, also be respectful if other people, if there's more than one person in the uh, room doing tuning, just be respectful, ask in the chat uh, permission uh, before you start tuning um, as well. Okay then, so uh, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in another video.